Hello and welcome to another Performance Architects How-To. Performance Architects is a business and technology consulting company that helps companies initiate and sustain big changes in their performance management and business intelligence environments and process. This video along with others on our channel should help provide some additional insight as you embark on or continue along your EPM and BI journey. Head over to our channel after this video or come back in the future to learn best practices, hear overviews, and take part in lessons we have designed to help you. We are focused on continuing to develop this community and we welcome any recommendations you might have for future content. Thanks and enjoy. Hello and welcome to Performance Architects How To. My name is Robert. In this How To, we will be discussing how to reverse engineer an Oracle database in Visio 2010. So a quick little agenda for you. We will be using Visio 2010 to create a database connection to our desired database. Then I'll show you how to reverse engineer that database. And then we'll play a little around with some of the things that you can do with the reverse engineered database in Visio. So now to the demo. So here we are in Visio. 2010. And if a database model diagram is not an option for you under the recently used templates, you can come over here to software and databases. And the one I like to use is this database model diagram. So now it's opened up a blank diagram for us. You'll notice there is nothing down here in our tables and views area. So we'll go ahead and click on the database. And then we'll go ahead and click reverse engineer and we'll now need to create a connection. So we'll go ahead and choose Oracle Server and New. And we'll go ahead and hit User Data Source. Next. Go to the bottom here. We'll go to the Oracle Home I have for my Oracle database I have. Next. And go ahead and hit Finish. Okay. So we will be reverse engineering a DRM version 11 database and that is also the TNS names. And we'll go ahead and use the system account. Let's go ahead and test that. There we go. Successful. Good. Just put in a description here. And hit OK. All right. So now we have DRM 11. And we'll go ahead and hit next. Put in the password and username again. And here are the different options for things that we can reverse engineer. Personally, I don't use the stored procedures very much. So I usually uncheck that. But typically speaking, the rest of it I have used and enjoy using. So typically speaking, primary keys, indexes, and foreign keys are probably the most useful for what I've done. So we'll go ahead and select all of those. And next. And now it's querying the database. And so here we have it. And so if we scroll down, we'll have DRM. And let's go ahead and export the export section. and select all the tables you want to export. You can also use select all if you are limited to the particular subset that you would like. I'll go ahead and hit it next. And I usually say no. I'd rather add the sh shapes myself afterwards. And next. And there we go. Just a little review and hit finish. Now it'll do its thing, finding all the keys and all the associated tables and then bring it all in for us. There we go. That's all done. So now one of the neat things you can do with reverse engineered database is go ahead and pull in col er, tables. If we zoom in, you can see primary keys, foreign keys, indexes are the eyes, and unique constraints. One of the things I like to do most with this when you're trying to learn a new database is if you click on a table and you right mouse click, of all the options here, one of the ones I like the most is show related tables. So if you click that, it will now pull in 
all the related tables for you to that table you're on. And then you can move them all around to whatever setup makes sense for you. And there you go. This has been a how-to on how to reverse engineer a database using Visio 2010 and Oracle. Thank you for joining and please visit Performance Architect's how-to channel for other videos on enterprise performance management and business intelligence solutions.